welcome to another instrument choice support video. In this video, we will discuss the difference between scales and balances and why it's essential to know. Scales and balances are both weighing machines. However, the critical difference is that a scale measures weight while a balance measures mass. What is mass? Mass is essentially the amount of matter in an object. The basic unit of measurement for mass is the kilogram. The mass of an object stays the same, irrespective of location and gravitational forces. Weight is the force of gravity on an object, measured using a scale. Depending on gravitational forces, the weight of an object will change depending on where in the world you are. The associated SI unit of force and weight is the Newton. However, most scales will convert and report the result in mass units, such as grams or kilograms. Scales. The design and inner workings of scales will vary between brands, but they work to measure weight by using force. The measurement of force is through the tension force of a constraint acting on an object, opposing the local effect of gravity. Most scales convert the measured force to resulting mass at Earth's gravity. So to summarise this principle, weighing scales import the force exerted by an object and will display results in mass. An example of this force measurement is with a spring scale, where the spring either stretches, for example hanging scales in a supermarket, or compresses, like a bathroom scale, when an object is applied. The associated stretch or compression of the spring will allow the scale to estimate the gravitational force applied by the item. A balance determines the mass of an object by balancing an unknown mass against a known mass, for example with an older style two pan balance. Today, modern electronic balances generally use a force restoration mechanism to create a force to balance, due to the unknown mass. As such, they often must have calibration adjustments made to compensate for gravitational differences. Key considerations when purchasing a scale or balance. The instrument choice scientists recommend four key considerations when choosing between a scale or a balance. One is readability. Balances often offer better readability than scales. Balances are more commonly used to measure tiny weight increments precisely. Two is cost. Balances are generally more expensive than scales due to the precision and enhanced features that they offer. Three is capacity. Make sure the balance or scale you are considering has a weight capacity that's suitable for the items you're wishing to evaluate. Four is application. Make sure that any additional features are suitable for the job at hand. A platform scale would be overkill for the kitchen, and a kitchen scale probably wouldn't cut it in many industrial applications. Scales and balances are essential forms of scientific equipment used in a wide range of environments. Knowing the difference between the two and applying the four considerations recommended by our team will ensure that you find a scale or balance that's perfect for any job. Do you need more information or want a bit of help finding the perfect scale or balance for your application? Contact one of the Instrument Choice Scientists. Details are in the description. We hope you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.